Welcome, Pisces, to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of November 1st to the 15th of 2023. As I was getting into the Piscean energy, um, I really feel as if you're, you are paying attention to the signs. So you're paying attention to what your awareness is bringing to your attention. Uh, a lot of people including Pisces, will allow that stuff to go over their heads. And we all do from time to time. But for the Pisces, during this particular time, you're hyper aware of what's going on, even with others around you. The sense of a new beginning. So this could be a new outlook, a, a new way of thinking. Uh, somebody comes back, there's a conflict resolved and there has to be this new beginning. So you cannot keep thinking this person uh, and what they've done or what you've done. I feel that stay out of the cattiness after this all resolves itself and just move forward. Uh, career and finance. I feel that some of you uh, may be feeling the Ah, the shock, the, oh my God, what am I going to do? I got to do something kind of thing. Um, I feel like you guys have an ace. I just saw an ace up the sleeve. <laughs> so many of you, a new beginnings, again, new beginnings. So get this rolling, get this going um, and pay attention to what you're seeing and go with it. Uh, stay light. Stay light. Keep your prayer strong. Uh, in a time of conflict, in a time of conflict, it's very important to go within, uh, keep your prayer strong. And remember, if you live, if you are in conflict, personal conflict, or there's conflict around you, peace. So sing songs of peace. If you're uh, musically inclined, play an instrument um, because you can change your energy, Pisces. So there is this new beginning. Go with it and go with it with the frequency of joy, happiness, and laughter. Even if you have to fake it, um, some, uh, uh, you know, my, my, the closest people around me, uh, when they're telling me their next step in life and how difficult and they can't see it happening or how they're going to do it, I'll turn and I'll look at them and I'll say, ha, 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 ha. And then this way they'll start laughing. And I said, no, you just changed your frequency. Now you can do it <laughs> because it's changing that electromagnetic frequency, Pisces. Getting good news. God bless you. Let's go with love, romance, relationship, and that could be where that good news is coming in from. You're currently in conflict. It flipped out inside the deck. So there is somebody coming back from the past where there's been conflict and there's going to be resolution. So here it is. Uh, it, it's, this is good, another good card. Roll with it when it comes to um, the relationships. This could be in love or in romance, absolutely. But for many of you, you're going to find that this was uh, somebody dear and near to you. There will be this new beginning. And here's this new beginnings card in love, romance, and relationship. And some of you are saying, Petrella, no, no, that's dead and gone. I'll never go there again. Pisces, yeah, at a crossroads, love, romance, and relationship. And, you know, I think the word truth, truth is coming out. So whether this is the Piscean being true to how they really feel, that doesn't mean you need to blurt it out to the world, but it's how you really feel or the other person that's coming, circling back around and how they really feel. Career finance, Pisces, November 1st to the 15th of 2023. What does the divine have in store for thee, Pisces? Uh, 
I want to say I realize this does not resonate with all of you, but it does for many of you. And I do appreciate it because the Pisces has really helped my channel to grow, whether it's through private readings, donations, and fast but free. Uh, you can like, share, and subscribe my channel and leave a kind comment. I believe all those things help my channel to grow. And uh, for some reason, some things go viral and others, well, none of my stuff, but I'm still trying to really figure that out. Which, by the way, I am a Pisces. <laughs> Stay out of the cattiness. Pisces, I see that there may be... May, there's something going on. Like I need more of an explanation with this. Well, at the bottom of the deck is the commitment. Oh, and it's about money. Pisces. Career finance. November 1st to the 15th of 2023. Yeah, it's going to look good for thee. Got it. You guys got this, Pisces. Oh, my God. You got this. It's successful. Look, this is such great news. <laughs> you know, I do, uh, I share readings. You know, I have other readers on YouTube call me and say, hey, Petrella, will you do an exchange? And, um, and I'm always good for that. And here, I got to tell you, oftentimes they'll say, Petrella, did you watch your own Pisces? And I'm like, no, because I don't want to see it. But here, I am a Pisces. This is the key to success. So many of you actually already have something going on in the works. Or this could be just an idea that you have not implemented energy into yet. Career finance, Pisces. And then I'm going to, uh, here we go. Oh, oh, good. So here's career finance. You need to cut out what no longer serves you. And this could even be people. If they're draining you of your time and energy, let it go. And here it is, the new beginning. God, look at that sunrise coming. I just heard one of the birds chirping outside. Um, now, when I do my private readings, I usually do the shadow side of this of the person that I'm reading and their strength during um, this particular time. So when I'm reading the person, I know who I'm reading. So November 1st to the 15th, what would the shadow side of the Pisces be? And when I say that, it's just something that you need to work on. Yeah, it's the quarreling and the fighting. You need to be able to walk away. I, I know that many of you are so strongly intuitive uh, that you could use your words like zingers and you could cut somebody to the quick with just um, a, a mere sentence. <laughs> Don't do that. All right, just walk away and just don't do that. Do your do them a favor and help them grow in love. Because you know when you see a lower level thinker, just, oh, that's one of the signs. You just know, you can thank them for showing you who, you, who they are and then just kind of leave. So that is your shadow side, is your um, quick uh, words, thoughts, you're, I, I bet you even have quick wit, but um, sarcasm, but don't use it against another to just make them feel bad because you got to realize where they're coming from. It could be a lower level energy. Just and let it go. This is your strength, Pisces. The strength of the Pisces. Yeah, here we go. Yes. When you shine, you shine. This is your strength. And I do feel that many of you are able to um, bring to light your light bringers. You actually help more people than you know. And when I say light bringers, this is also happiness. So when you're happy, 
many people around you because this is this energy that we put off, right? So, and you're so good at putting off that energy and that's why you're able, Pisces, to manifest. I don't care if it's, you know, uh, uh, finances or what it is, but you're able to do it because this is your strength. So, Pisces, if this resonated with you and you would like a private reading, patrollasintuitiveinsights.com, listed in the link below. Um, also, for those of you that have uh, helped my channel get this far, it's fast and it's free and it really does help me. Click the like, share, and subscribe button and leave a kind comment. And um, again, for those of you that donated to my channel, I really greatly appreciate it. Thank you and God bless you.